So we just started releasing the Monarch butterflies last summer, and so far we've released over 80 butterflies. Yeah, so we have um, what I believe is a male and a female in here. Um, let's see. This would be our female. And or this one, boy. his wings are closed, but this is the male. And typically on a male, you will see two small round spots just in his hind wings down here. And that will let you know whether he's a male or a female. He won't be still, so we can't really see those two little circles right there at the bottom. Yeah, they're like right there. Yeah, right they're next to his body at the bigger. bottom. There's little circles there that the female doesn't have. So we have a male here and we have a female here that we're going to be releasing. So she's going to Hello. take them out so we can let them go. Oh no, it's getting windy. Now when you want to pick up a butterfly, you want to put your finger right under its body. Here's the butterfly. And, oh, oh there goes eyes. one already. He flew away pretty quickly. Yeah, they're they're ready to go. Now, monarch butterflies prefer milkweed. They will only lay eggs on a milkweed plant, and they do prefer to also eat milkweed plant. But recently, monarch butterflies are dwindling in numbers, most likely because there's not enough food for their migration to Mexico every year. So there's not as many monarch butterflies. So if everybody just planted some milkweed, they'd have more food and there would be more monarch butterflies. They are the only butterfly in the world that actually migrates during the winter to Mexico. And then once winter is over, they migrate back up north. So they need plenty of food to make that migration. Put your finger right under the front of its body, right under his head. Open. Get in there. Yeah. So this is a special cage that we hold. Ah, am I close to a chrysalis? No. Okay. Make sure you get it. This is a special cage that we hold the, the caterpillars and the butterflies yeah. in until they're ready to be released so they're safe just, like, because there are things it. out there that will attack them if we leave them outside. We will make sure we release as many as possible. Come here. Alright, let's see. You guys. This one's being stubborn, huh? <laughs> if you want to get outside, then come on my finger. Nope. Sometimes they'll come right to you without a problem. Every now and then you have some that <gasps> just don't want to interfere with people. Yeah. Oh so, my gosh. All right. Well, there he goes already. <laughs> that was quick. Bye-bye. They usually like to be released in um, sunny days. You won't really see them come out when it's cloudy and not very sunny outside, or especially rainy. If it's raining, you don't want to release the butterflies. You want to talk about the chrysalis? And then, yep. So we have three chrysalises left. We have one here and then two over there. Yep. They make these really pretty chrysalises with gold spots and gold around the top. And there's two left up here. And they'll probably be coming out sometime. Looks like that one, they start to get dark. And once yeah. they start to get dark, they'll probably come out within like a day or two. August. That one probably has a few days left. It's a little blurry in this in the cage, but see the pretty gold spots. Guys, guess what? Okay. So I have some good news about my gymnastics. That was the only two we had. Today, I learned how to do a front handspring on the ground. Are you fucking kidding me? We're so proud because we know how much you love your gymnastics. All right. Let's finish. We let our butterflies go. We've released many butterflies so far, and it's getting close to the end of the butterfly season, so there probably won't be too many more coming lately. But we also decided we love our butterflies so much that for her birthday, we decided to do her room in butterflies. Let's go check it out. Guys, her new butterfly bedroom. And the dog. So this is her new room that she got for her birthday. 
yeah we love our butterflies so she wanted to do her room in butterflies it's so colorful and pretty and look on the, Many on butterflies. the wall it says spread your wings and fly and we even put them on the wall spread your wings and fly so today that we did our butterfly release we hope that you learned something new about our monarch butterflies and that now you can start planting your own milkweed and having your own monarch butterflies to help out with their migration since their population is decreasing. So, yeah, that's what we wanted to do. So, bye! Thanks for watching. Hope you subscribe and like.